A variable frequency drive, often abbreviated as VFD, is a type of mechanical drive system used to control AC motor speed and torque by varying motor input frequency and voltage. A VFD allows you to adjust the power supplied to the machine to match the system requirements of the driven element. In effect, the machine shaft doesn't rotate at the speed of the nameplate RPM. In order to analyze vibration data, you will need to find the actual RPM to input into your data collector. In order to calculate the RPM of a VFD, you must locate the 1x frequency on the spectrum. 1x refers to the vibration at the same frequency as the run speed of the machine. The equation to calculate 1x is the actual frequency divided by the potential frequency equals x divided by the RPM on the machine nameplate. For example, 50 Hz over 60 Hz, the standard cycle frequency in the US, is equal to 1x over 1800 RPM. This means that our 1x, or the RPM of our VFD, equals 1500. When using this formula, it is important to note the difference between synchronous and asynchronous machines. Synchronous motors have a special rotor construction that allows them to rotate at the same speed as the stator field. Asynchronous, or induction motors, have slip, which is the discrepancy between the rotational speed of the stator field and the somewhat slower speed of the rotor. This means that the 1x formula only provides a ballpark speed of the VFD's RPM. However, this ballpark speed is still usable for collecting vibration data from a machine.